This past week, school was dismissed early Wednesday and closed on Thursday and Friday due to a nor'easter that hit the area, dropping nearly a foot of snow. The storm forced numerous closures, knocked down trees and power lines, and knocked power out to more than half of Hopkinton and heavily affected numerous other towns. Senator Karen Spilka stopped by the HCAM studios and gave us an update on restoring power in the area. Uh, can you talk about what you have been doing to assist with uh, recuperating from the storms? Sure. Um, I have a um, close relationship with Eversource, you know, over these last, you know, few months from working to, to prevent the gas gate from coming to, to Hopkinton um, or uh, or even expanding for them to expand, working with uh, John Coutinho and Norman Kamalo and, and Rep Dykema and others and the Board of Selectmen in town to, to prevent that from happening. So, um, and I've worked with Eversource for a while in hearing from my communities how many people still were without power last night and this morning. Um, I spoke with uh, town manager Kamalo this morning to let him know that I had already called Eversource and asked them to get crews in Hopkinton and the surrounding towns in Metro West that too many people were still without power, without electricity, without heat, and it was becoming a dangerous situation for for folks, whether they be you know infants all the way up to, to our seniors, and that we needed to remedy this. So I know they did send crews out to Hopkinton and the surrounding towns, and I'm getting updated regularly. I'm hearing many of the families, many of the households have had their power restored and by tomorrow the hope is and they're, they're telling me uh, the restoration should be complete. 